Porter is probing. Tate pirouetting. Trying to dunk it back was Tari Easton. Could not do so because he got fouled by Marshall. CJ's got a million moves. He does. Oh, and then Marshall takes it away. And a two for one. For a, 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 a second straight possession here for New Orleans to end the quarter. Up top, Marshall got it off and buried it at the buzzer. Yeah, since they last played the Rockets in New Orleans on January the 4th, is that no good? Tip try no good. Scooped up there by Marshall. They're 9 and 23 cents. That's no good. Tip try no good. Scooped up there by Marshall. They're 9 and 23 cents. Rockets basically almost have as many wins as they do over that same time frame. And they really hurt the Rockets. I mentioned it the other night. They hurt the Rockets in that department. Usman Garuba rounded out on the corner three as the Rockets shooting woes continue. They missed 11 of their 14 shots. And there goes Marshall. This is such an impactful guy. And quite honestly, there are so few true impactful players in the league. There's so many talented guys, but truly impactful players. And he's one of them is McCullough. He gets after getting again. Out rebounded on Friday night, 52 35. So. They're executing so far in this game, and they're not messing around for sure. Marshall. And the one thing you know when, when you're playing against Najee Marshall, whether you're guarding him or you're on the weak side, he's coming at you. He's going to be getting downhill. That's just a, a huge part of the way he plays. And it knocked away. Oh, oh he got it back. Goodness. He got it back. And then he misses. They had like there five, you go. five opportunities to score on that possession. Tari's in six of six. Rockets down only nine. Eight minutes to go. New Orleans typically a really good fourth quarter team as Valanciunas in a row for the Pelicans. Jalen Green getting a rest, not certain.